All right, everybody, welcome back. <clears throat> Thank you all very much for hanging out with me today. You have a lot of choices of what to watch during the day, I'm sure, and just grateful you're spending some time with old Zeke. All right, we're going to watch the, um, the highlight video of the Emily, Emily is away too. Sorry. Hey. Hey. Sup? Hey, we had Vesper Von Doom. Vesper Von Doom. With her 27 month re-up. Thank you, Vesper. Also, Sunlit Karma with nine months. Thank you guys very much. All right, we're going to watch the five, five and a half minute highlight video from Emily is Away 2. I think uh, made by Mr. Made by Mr. Scott Evans. It's private until 5 p.m. today, so about 20 minutes. I think it'll go live. I'm not sure, but we're gonna watch it now. We're gonna preview it now. I'm gonna get off, get off the uh, screen here, and we're gonna check it out. Let's get on to the game of the day or game of the moment, which is Emily was away or Emily is away too, which I am. Ne I've never. I didn't play the first one. So, I don't know what this game is all about. I have no clue. I'm wondering if I have to play the first one. Do I have to play the first one to understand the second one? Brand new story featuring new characters and multiple different endings. Message your friends, surf the web, and choose your path to this branching narrative. Okay. It says new, so hopefully. I have no idea what this is about either. I know I don't know. what It seems like it might be like a... Like, psychological something or other? Why aren't you in a relationship? <laughs> I don't know! <laughs> oh, God, too real. Too real! Seemed like such a great catch. Ah, fuck this fucking game! <laughs> <laughs> Mom, go away! I'm on the internet, Mom! I'm chatting with my friends! Go away! Hang up the phone! Hang up the phone! And bring me a hot pocket. You actually want me to talk about it? I'm always here, yeah. What's bothering you? Oh my god, I'm a friend! I'm the friend they talk to about their boyfriends! Ah! <laughs> I hate this game! <laughs> I hate everything! I dig I, I, Why doesn't anyone like me? <laughs> I'm mom, I'm fine! I'm fine, mom! I'm not crying! Where's my hot pocket? <laughs> Fine. Fine. <laughs> Fine. I'm just feeling so sad and worthless. Perfect. <laughs> sad and worthless. That's when Zeke swoops in and picks them up and tries to repair their sad and worthless lives and then ends up fucking them up all the worse. Go get them, Zeke. <laughs> Mark, though, where would I go? Question mark. You're such a genuine person. Oh, oh, this is bad. No, don't. Oh, God, man. I thought it, I'm in the outer circle of the friend zone. She's going to stuff me right in the fucking chewy nougat center of the fucking friend zone. <laughs> Not just friends. Come on. Come on! I was thinking that too! Oh, oh. oh, smiley face! Smiley face! I got colon and parentheses! Colon and parentheses! <laughs> Your advice to call Steve out and tell my friends the truth was incredible! Incredible! Do you hear that? Mom! Mom, I'm incredible! Do you hear that? Someone thinks I'm incredible! She's not home, she's gambling. Okay. <laughs> um, you're, do you mean like as your date? <laughs> if 
if that's cool with you. Yeah! Woo! I was hoping you were gonna ask me. Boom, 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 boom! Woo! Mom! I'm on the fucking internet! No! Use the neighbor's phone! What are you up to? Just on the computer. Let's not get too sappy. Let's not be that couple that's like, I'm just thinking of you. Now I'm just thinking of you. Now you hang out. Now you hang out. I don't want to be that couple. <laughs> Horror movies are your favorite. We're both pretty mature, I think. We both want different things in life, but we want different things in life. So I don't know, maybe? You're a really good friend and I don't want to lose that. Oh! No! <laughs> no, it's too real! It's too real! Ah, it's too real! I can't, I don't wanna. I don't wanna do it and I don't wanna play anymore. <laughs> Everyone who made it. <laughs> I like that you end the fucking video with that. That's so great. You end the video with fuck this game and anyone who made it. <laughs> That's a fucking great capper to that. Oh my god. <laughs> that was a very nice work. Very nice work. Good job, Scott. <laughs> I love that. That last clip, <clears throat> that last clip was the first time I said it's too real. I was like, it's too real, it's too close. Oh my God, this is my life. This is what happened. It happened to me all the time in high school. All the time. I could never close a deal. I could buddy up, I could get really close. And at that tipping point, it's like, ugh, friend zone or, or relationship. And it would always go, here into the chasm of friend zone all day all day that was me until after high school though after high school though when no one knew me like i that's thunder outside wow it is thundering outside <laughs> Um, anyway, but after high school, like I wasn't around the same people all the time. So I could kind of change my persona and I started smoking cigarettes and going to bars and drinking. And once you start like that down that path, like all that other shit, like, like the, the friend, like I'll, you can trust me kind of shit, like goes a little bit on the wayside. And you're just like on a mission for tail. And it worked for a while. It was the the um the benefit of youth. Zeke found whores. No, there's no there's not a lot of whores in, in Montana. Not a lot of prostitutes. Or people or women selling sex for money. Doesn't happen a lot. All right. No, I was just more, I was more direct and more straightforward uh, after high school. I wasn't like, I want you to care about me and if and if I fuck this up, you're gonna tell everyone at school. No, when you're out bar, at bars like trolling for strange, you say whatever you want. And if they tell you to fuck off and they, uh, that you're a pig and they hate you, well, you're probably not gonna see him again for a while at least. But if you're direct and, and they respond, <laughs> go get them. <clears throat> yeah, I was, I was a lot more direct out of high school. And, you know, honest, like honesty stating what I want 
I wouldn't beat around the bush, I guess, so to speak. I'd take him straight to Clown Town. Going about this all wrong, you're a streamer in Montana. You get that yourself laid, you won't have any trouble. You get that yourself laid. Oh, you get yourself laid, you won't have any trouble. Yeah. 100 cups of coffee for four months in a row. I appreciate it. Welcome back. And one of my favorite screen names, Punishing Babies for eight months in a row. I can't, okay. Okay. All right. I mean, it certainly feels like I have to drag something over here. Yeah, he's gonna fucking, he got me in. No, I think it's about I I don't think it's nice guy or jerk. I think it's confidence. Cuz I'm I'm still a nice guy, but I'm just more direct and more confident. Like I excuse me, I got more direct and more confident. And everybody, everybody, not just not just people you want to have sex with, everybody picks up on confidence. They can feel it emanating off you and they want to be around someone who's more confident. Oh, motherfucker! Oh, damn it. Oh, wait. Oh, shit. There's a thing. I didn't even see this. Up! Up! Oh, my God. How did I not see this? Pull it! Pull it, kid! Pull it! There you go. Get him out of here. Seriously? I can't jump on that? That's not what they want, huh? I wonder what they want. Just, just that? Okay. Okay, there we go. Can't confirm mods or clowns. By the way, if you're not following Future Man Gaming, don't don't bother. It's not worth it's not worth a follow.
<laughs> now, I think I just celebrated a, a subversary in your channel the other day. I don't know how many, like 17 months or something? I don't know. Maybe it was longer than that, I'm not sure. Get him! And definitely do not tune in for the E3 pre pre show. Don't do not tune in for the E3 pre pre show. Oh, was it? Oh, it's 25 months. That's right. I got I got the uh, the FMG whatever two year badge. ship over there. Here we go. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, I, already, I already did that, didn't I? Oops. Whoopsie doodle. What are you guys doing over here? Having a little uh, circle jerk? Playing the playing ookie cookie or limp biscuit? Yeah, but I think I think uh, Brownie has one up on you because I think she's she's actually from like born and raised in New York. You're a you're a a, a mid southerner, aren't you, Future Man? Like Virginia or one of the Carolinas or something? I could be wrong. I could be thinking of somebody else. Oh wait, no, Wisconsin. Just stay in Montana, you fuck. <laughs> Didn't you and I establish I'm the most non-New Yorker ever? Did we establish that? What were the what were the criteria for that? Ha! Raised in Missouri. That's right. Because he willingly deals with Jeff Leach. <laughs> 
Is there a way to change the text color in the text color in the box where I'm typing? I beat the DV dark on dark mode. I can barely see what I'm typing. Are you sure it's better Twitch TV dark mode, or do you have just Twitch dark mode on? Because Twitch dark mode is super dark. It, it, you, it's hard to see where you're typing. Because I, I do that sometimes, where I turn on Twitch dark mode and not better Twitch TV dark mode. <laughs> Define willingly. Another keyhole. Fixed in the oh yeah! Oh yeah! We know it would love her hail, Chaonix. Berserker. <laughs> what up, Ko? How you doing? Oh, now how come? I swear to God, I pressed X on these before. I swear to God I pressed X on that other one. Like, there's only one thing you can do. Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, and I have... Uh, if I have the wrong dark mode on, I have trouble seeing... Uh, black names like Sitley's name. I have trouble seeing it against the background, but if I have the right dark mode on, I can see it just fine. And also, sometimes, sometimes it helps if I go into my extensions for whatever browser I'm using, turn it off, refresh, turn it on, and refresh again. It'll it'll reset the uh, the the Twitch the better Twitch TV values I think. Yeah, it's dark gray, but like my name, my my name and Sitley's name have the same value, I think. Yeah, we have the ours has the same value, so it appears the same. But in, in other in other dark modes, it it blends into the background. Have you ever bought a prostitute, Zeke? I plead the fifth. I shouldn't have read that question out loud, I don't think. Motherfuck. Am I not? Okay. <clears throat> I can make it to that. I can make it! Oh! Rocket! Rocket! Where are you, Rocket? I hear you! Red Rocket! Red Rocket! Where are you? Oh, there we go. Okay. Wait, no, no.
Holy farts! Fucking busted that shit up like it went nothing. The oldest profession for a reason, yeah. I live in Nevada as long as you're in Clark County buying a prostitute ain't no big thing. Thank you very much, Chaonix. Sorry, I just need all the badges. <laughs> oh, there you are! If it's the old profession, what was used as currency? Um, protection. Like if, like I would, I would. This is just me, like making a, an assumption. I would assume that women who were prostitutes would sell sex in order for the men they were having sex with to protect them. Probably from other men. <laughs> or food. Yeah, food, protection, kind of like a pimp. Can I have more hugs at TwitchCon? Yes. Yes, you may, Chaonix. I will give you a hug at TwitchCon. off anybody can have hugs if you come see me at twitchcon I'd much rather hug you than shake your hand not only is it more sanitary but it's a nicer way to show affection than a handshake like it's not a like if if you know me from Twitch being a streamer or a viewer come up and hug me Also Zeke smells good real talk <laughs> Jesus, come on, man. Nope. What about the highest fives? High fives are good too, but only if you catch me on the rebound. So, high fives only work if they're a high five, then you turn around and you put your hands like that behind you and I give you the 10 in the back or the need for speed high five the walking by smack smack if we're of a similar height you have to be kind of a similar height in order for that for the need for speed one to work but if you want to we could do high five turn around 10 on the rebound
Yeah, I know it's Top Gun. I feel the need, the need for speed. I'm a high maintenance high fiver. I am. Goddamn right. Like Oprah Winfrey said, ask for what you want 100% of the time. I live by that credo. Ask for what you want 100% of the time. No need to be a dick. Just ask. I ask that if you want to give me a high five instead of a hug, but you give me a high five my way. All right. Now what the fuck? I can get up here. Or not. You know, I don't have to get up there if I don't want to. No big deal. <clears throat> I went to PAX East and met two streamers I followed for a while. First thing I'd done was hug them and grab them on the ass at the same time. Then we went for beers. <laughs> Sounds like a good day. Fuck you! Ah, no! God damn you. <laughs> you stupid bird. There you go. Extend the bridge or something. Yeah, there you go. Oh, I need... Oh, it'll tilt. I'll jump on the edge and it'll tilt a little bit. Okay. Maybe?
They look like the blocks from Fifth Element. Too bad, that movie's crap. Oh, there you go. I will fly to your house and punch you in the daddy bags. Oh, not the mommy daddy button. <laughs> oh, Teddy P, you keep trying to talk. You keep trying to talk, but you keep getting shut down. What's going on, Teddy? What's happening? Hey, listen, we're not all going to like the same things, okay? That's just life. Oh, the ship came alive and ate him. But I will say that if you like the fifth element, that we will never be like super close friends, like ever. <laughs> oh, fuck me! sad in my heart. Oh, mother shit. Mother pus bucket. Oh, I can climb up the net. Okay, good. curiosity what is it about the fifth element you don't like it has some of my some of my like favorite actors and it's just a bad just a bad job of acting okay so okay there you go thank you I will medicate it. I will. We'll hug and we'll dance. If you guys feel like dancing with me too, I get in the. I get in that goddamn pit. At the TwitchCon party, I get in the pit and I get sweaty and I dance like a fucking madman. So if you're down for that, I'm down. I'm in. That goes for anybody. If you guys are at the Twitch party at TwitchCon and you want to get in the pit and get sweaty with me. Pits are scary. They're not that scary. It's a it's a pit full of sweaty Twitch nerds. I mean, come on. How scary can it be? It's not like we're at a fucking metal show. I'll protect you. Medicated, I'll protect you both. 
I'm a big dude. I got lots of protection. I'll protect you like Mac from fucking uh, Always Sunny. I'll claw. I'll, I'll give. I'll give everybody a, uh, an ocular pat down. <laughs> Darude was fucking stellar though, Vesper, dude. I was I was a little like apprehensive myself, but Ve Darude killed it. I didn't get a seat to pain. I didn't get a seat to pain, but I saw Darude and he was awesome. <laughs> you jabroni. <laughs> Uh, oh, there, hey! Here I come, Red Rocket! Red Rocket, come here! Um, no, Darude, uh, uh, Dead Mouse. Those guys were great. Stevie Oki was great too, but it didn't, like, the second TwitchCon didn't seem like it was as, the second, second TwitchCon party out in the, the baseball field didn't seem like it was as inviting and as, like, community as, like, the first one that was in this big, like, auditorium dome-ish looking thing. Because in the thing, like in the first one, they had this huge dance floor in the center, but all the way around it, like above, were balcony chairs that everybody could sit in and just watch the show. Or, And if you wanted to dance, you'd go downstairs. It was perfect. I loved it. Where'd you go? There you are. Hey! Hey! Yeah, no place to sit at the ballpark. Yeah, you had to go way away from the party and the music to sit down. Am I humongous? Just walk away. Just walk away. I am humongous. No, I'm not humongous. I'm 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 six one two thirty. So I'm I'm larger than average, but I'm not like a fucking giant. No. We go in, we kill. <laughs> All right, have a good night, Keonix. the voice crack it's so good give me that piece thank you the Ayatollah of rock and roller I gotta watch that movie again. I gotta watch Mad Max. Uh, wait, is that Thunderdome? No, that's not Thunderdome. That's just Mad Max, right? Or no, it's uh, the Road Warrior. Excuse me. Mad Max is number one. Road Warrior is number two. Mad Max Beyond Thunderdome is three.
And I don't know if you guys out there agree with me, but if you want to watch Mad Max, I don't think you I don't think you need to actually watch the first Mad Max. I think you can start with Road Warrior and just watch that one, Mad Max Beyond Thunderdome, and Fury Road. I think you'll be fine with those three. The first one is kind of weird. Trevelyan, what were you playing? Huge host. That's a big old fatty host from Trevelyan. Thank you very much, my man. Delete your account. It was meh. How dare you say it was meh? <laughs> no, honestly, I liked. My favorite is probably Road Warrior. It's probably in order. It goes Road Warrior, Thunderdome, and then Fury Road. I love Road Warrior. Really, really, really like uh, Thunderdome, and then like a lot Fury Road. Fury Road was mediocre! And I like Thunderdome because it was campy. Because it was it was a little goofy. Because it was uh Who run Barter Town? Who run Barter Town? Him, Blaster, me, Master. <laughs> Fury Road was great. Oh, baby, we got a new sub. Hail, TikTok, Burrseeker. Thank you, TikTok. Appreciate that juicy Prime sub. Was playing Fallout 4. Remember the Fallout 4. Remember the copy you gave me and suggested I eat a fat wet poop. <laughs> I do remember that. <laughs> remember the copy you gave me and <laughs> suggested I eat a fat wet poop. I do. I remember that. <laughs> he called us fat, wet poops because of you. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> Man, I'm hilarious. Tell me more about what I've said in the past, and we'll and I'll laugh. I promise. Uh, <laughs> where's the where's that goddamn fox? Long time lurker, love your stream and chat, all amazing. Well, thank you, Hayes. Hayes won. <sighs> I, I, the, yeah, the, the voice says poop. A fat wet poop. Okay, there's got to be like a central focal point that I'm supposed to like go to. Oh, that big thing? You think? There's got to be like, where? Uh, there's got to be some sort of landmark that I'm supposed to go to. Oh, okay. Give me the cash. Give me the cash. No, I am a meat popsicle. The 
fuck did I do? I didn't even see, I was looking at chat. What the fuck? How did I fall down? You just oh you clipped it from today okay. Oh, I ran into I ran into red rocket. Oh. The 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 sneaky or the the. The s sly? No. Yeah, the sly brown fox jumped over the yellow dog? No. The quick brown fox jumped over the yellow dog. Or the lazy... The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. That's what it is. The yellow dog? Yellow dog is from, uh... National Lampoon's Christmas... Or National Lampoon something. They had Yellow Dog. Oh, no, no, no. That was Funny Farm. Chevy Chase. Funny Farm. So, uh, hey guys. Oh. Hey. Oh, they're, oh, they're, oh. Oh. Pushy, pushy shovesies, is it? <laughs> well. I'm just seeing if I missed anything. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. He's fine. Yeah, the music in this game is awesome. I love it.
question. Since I was bagging on the fifth element earlier, what do you think is the movie that I could say in any Twitch chat, I could say, man, that's a terrible movie. And it would create the most hate. Like people would be like, are you fucking serious? What do you think would incite like a riot? Ooh, Back to the Future? Space Jam? <laughs> Boondock Saints, I've bagged on Boondock Saints. Now, I'm, I can, I can stand watching The Fifth Element. I don't mind watching it. Boondock Saints, though? Ugh. Ugh. Godfather? Huh? Guardians of the Galaxy? Doc Holiday, come on, Doc Holiday. Come on, don't be like that. Big Lebowski, you think if I was like, I hate the Big Lebowski, I think it's dumb. Do you think I would decide to riot? I don't. <laughs> Hoop dreams. <laughs> what up, Peter Man Johnson? How you doing? Yeah, I think if I if I said I hated the Big Lebowski, I think there would be a lot of people going, that's just like your opinion, man. Now, uh, Schindler's List, I don't think like, if I said I didn't like Schindler's List, I think that'd be fine. Cause that's, that's a tough movie to watch. I think Back to the Future would be would be on the top like nobody doesn't like Back to the Future. I mean it's such a simple well done movie. A lot of people praise the Godfather of the years. I love the God. Godfather is my favorite. Like it shares the top spot for my favorite movies of all time. Godfather Part One and Transformers 1986. I think Princess Bride. I thought Princess Bride too. Like that was one of the first ones that came to mind. I was like Princess Bride. I think everybody likes Princess Bride at least a little bit. Unbearable. Oh shit, I'm back on the ship. Oh, did I say 86? 84? Whatever. Whatever. You know what I mean, though. Oh, okay. I just have to turn the stick. Cheese! Oh, it's KP. What's up, KP? How you doing? Uh, I am the Rhyme Community Manager, stopping in to say what's up and thank you for playing Rhyme. I'd love to hear what you think about it. Really, Darius? You're the Rhyme Community Manager. Awesome. Um, I, this fucking game is amazing. It's really good. Like, Rhyme... Like, <laughs> D 
Do you want do you want a soundbite without the word fucking in it? Like this game is fucking amazing. Ezekiel the third. Um <laughs> No, it's great, man. Zoom out of the gate. Uh Big Bad Teddy for six months in a row. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Um Yeah, this this game is is fantastic. It is uh the atmosphere is is perfectly well done. Um I like I like non-speaking protagonists. <clears throat> I mean for the most part, except the, except the odd ha and hey here and there. <laughs> um but every everything seems to be like super on point. The puzzles are great. They're very uh they're very uh um varied. I like th I like that they're all varied. Like you have shadow puzzles and then move the block puzzles and stuff like that. Um the music, I mean Like I, I, I honestly, I got um, the first time I, I, um, I yelled at the fox when I was when you're yelling at all four of the statues to get the fox for the first time. The first statue I yelled at, and it went, and it like filled in, and then the music like swelled. Like I got involuntary goosebumps from just the music's like swelling. I was like, this is uplifting. It was great. It was great. Did you hear the Lindsey Sterling track? She wrote it for rhyme. No, I haven't. Uh, I just gave Brandy C3 copies to give out to your viewers. Oh, nice. That's excellent. Thank you very much. I love that. It's beautiful. Brownie knows how to do it too. Did you, did you give her one to keep for herself though? Because if you didn't, Brownie, keep one for yourself. If he didn't give you one, or if uh, Darawas did not give you a copy to keep for yourself, keep one of them. Tim is easier. Okay, Tim. No, I really enjoy it and and I'm sure I'm sure you Tim, I'm sure you get this all the time or you, whoever the devs get it all the time, but it it obviously has that that Ico feel to it. Except thankfully, thank thank the the gods above that it's not an escort quest. Yes, thank Takarilla. <laughs> and I don't know if you I don't know if you were involved with if you're just in just the community manager for this game or you've been involved with Tequila Works with other stuff, but I also really enjoyed the sexy brutal. I thought that was a very well put together game. Yeah, Ico Studio Studio Ghibli, yeah. No, <laughs> you can be compared to a lot worse. And frankly, if I'm not if if I may be so bold, there are not enough games like that out there. Like I look forward I was I was I had like a, a raging heart on for The Last Guardian, and I loved it. So any games that, that are comparable or that are in the same kind of vein Give him, give him up, give him to me. Ha! 
Only involved with Rhyme. I work for... Oh, Team Greybox. Okay. Dreadnought, Greygoo. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Ha! Have I played Brutal Legend? I have. I have. I liked it. I didn't love it. I played a little bit of it. I was like, I get it. Just not something that I would like play until the end of it. Game Gorger with two months in a row. Thank you, Game Gorger. Uh, how far am I into it? I am into it four hours and like four hours and 15 minutes, something like that. in a circle son of a bitch hey fox fox tell me where to go foxy where'd you go foxy I don't know where to go Okay, fuckers. All right, it's a, it's. We're in the lost woods, boys. Oh, hey, what's this? way she'd have gone that way it would have taken us straight to the castle oh I hear singing Oh, hey, Brownie. Brownie, since you have you have uh, Steam codes, right, for the games, I'm assuming, I'm assuming you do. Uh, we'll do a raffle. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll go to a break here in about 10 minutes. We'll do, or no, no, actually, no, we'll just raffle them off at the end, unless you, have you already given them away? Anyway. Okay, Steam, yes, sir. Okay, you haven't given them away yet. Okay, so what we'll do is, We'll have a raffle at the end of the at the end of the broadcast, which is in about 40 minutes. And we'll just end we'll end the broadcast like that with the raffle. Okay. We'll end the broadcast with the raffle and then you just whisper them the codes when we when we um uh choose, get the winners out. Okay. Oh, Chaotica, you want me to look at the Discord?
Yeah, the raffle is open to everybody. Oh, hey, look, flames. I'm a, see this? I'm a prince, a bona fide prince. Rivals open all, except you. The great Satan was real and came to you, would you sell your soul for all your earthly desires plus prolonged life? Uh, if the devil was real, like we're assuming that the devil is real and not just some schmo saying he's the devil. Assuming the devil is real, would I sell my soul? I would know, of course I wouldn't sell my soul. If souls and the devil were 100% confirmed real, then no, of course I wouldn't sell my soul because that's an eternity of damnation. Eternity of damnation. Not worth. If you're asking me if some schmo came up to me on the street and said, uh, will you sell your soul to me? I'll give you a hundred bucks. Yep, I'll do it. I'll do, I'll do it a uh, thousand times over. So, by the way, guys, if you come up to me at a convention or whatever and you have a contract that says, I own your soul for $100, I'll do it. I'll sign. But, but it's, got, it's cash first, though. It's got to be cash at first, cash up front. Some MSC three K shirt. Yeah, this is my um, my Kickstarter shirt. I got for backing. I kickstarted the uh, Mr. Science Theater re up, and I got a lousy shirt. Actually, it's not lousy. How do you know the random guy won't sell your soul to the real devil? Because there, because there's no real devil. That's an easy one. Because there's no real devil. There's no angels. There's no goblins. <laughs> One of my, one of my, uh, 
One of my favorite uh, George Carlin bits. Angels. What's all this shit with angels? Angel shit. What about goblins? Whatever happened to goblins? actually just caught up with the final season or not the final season but the most recent season of Supernatural on Netflix I binged 10, 11, and 12 in the last week and a half, two weeks so yeah I'm caught up on Supernatural season 11 was pretty bad but the latest season pretty good season 12 was pretty good That is, that is one of those things where I'm like, I know this is shit. Like, I know Supernatural is, is popcorn, like, not great. It's definitely Guilty Pleasure Town. But I like it. Nothing with 11 season can possibly be bad. Wait a minute. This isn't where I came from, right? I am moving. I am progressing forward, right? That's not an end. That's not an exit. Without a trace. I have no idea what that means. Hold on. Let's check. Let's let's find out what that means. Let's see what that, that achievement means. Uh there we go. Wait. Oh, I'm on a different game. Uh there we go. Without a trace. Uh respect the past. Oh, okay. I didn't, uh, I didn't like, I didn't rub out any of the things, I guess. Please don't talk about House of Cards in the chat. I'm only two episodes in and I'm enjoying these two episodes. Or I enjoyed them. Ha! Oh, okay. It was merely a trick of the light. If you could Jedi magic or Jedi mind trick things, would you use it for immoral acts on other people? Yeah, but not not too immoral. Like I'd uh like I don't know. If it, I don't even know if it's if it's immoral. It's just childish. I'd make them like make people like rub their nipples. Like that's just off the top of my head. Be like, you want to rub your nipples, and they'd be like, 
talking to you as they're rubbing their nipples. So, uh, yeah, I was... Went to work today and... Oh, fuck you, man! Oh, I can't... Oh, no, no further, huh? Camera, camera, please, please turn around, camera. Please, thank you. Jesus Christ. Okay, there we go. I just, I was pressing, I was pressing right and not down. It wants you to press, it wants you to just keep the same direction you were holding that that time no I, immoral but not illegal I don't know I, I might might do some immoral and illegal shit to people who might have it coming Like, if there was just, you know, some asshole, I, like, at a bar, like, trying to start f a fight with somebody, I might, like, pull down your pants and underwear and quack like a duck. <laughs> like, something like that. <laughs> That's illegal. That's indecent exposure. <laughs> Say that Jedi mind trick nipple thing. Nipple line in the voice of Obi Wan. I can't do. I can't do uh, Alec Guinness. Alec Guinness is. He's got a voice all of his own. That's why he was one of the reasons why he was so popular. He's a good actor and he had a really cool voice. Hard to hard to uh, imitate for me. Would you use it for things like forcing kids to do their homework? I wouldn't use it on kids. Period. For nothing. this thing. Um, what? Why are you barking at? Excuse me. I'm sorry. I know I ended that sentence with a preposition. I apologize. From where are you barking? Yeah, I get it. There's a tree blocking the path. The tree's up there. These are explody. Okay. Duly noted. I didn't know they exploded. In a in a shower of light. Oh, 
Oh, hey, there's a drawing on the floor. the door you locked it behind you red rocket open the door god damn fox From whence, not from where? Nah, -uh, from where is fine. Tell me why you're right, Nogbad. Tell me why you're right. socks looking good oh thank you very much tell me lies tell me sweet little wise little, little wise little lies yeah <laughs> only douchebags say whence yeah kind of like uh like louis ck's bit and people from phoenix are phoenician From what source? From what place or source? So that, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, it would be whence without the from, so you're wrong too. From where? Or just whence because whence means from where so if you say from whence it would be from from where it would be redundant so it would be whence it came or from where it came would be synonymous So anybody who says this this is news to me like I just I just figured this out anybody who says from whence is being redundant Yeah so you don't need to say from you can say go back whence you came Cuz whence means from where For me whence we arrived. That is way off, Donald. That is way off. All right, so the kid takes the blue marble, explodes it up on top of the tower. the legs of, of the pot people. Hey, medicated, look! 
I found your ancient relatives. It's the pot people. Uh, anyways, Phelan uh, with 21 months in a row. Thank you, Phelan. Welcome back. It's good to see you. Pot people, pot people, taste like pot, smoke like people. <laughs> Uh oh, oh, I woke the daddy. All right, keep his mind. Take it easy. Peace. Sad, are you sad? Are you okay? Where are you where are you going? You walk like my grandma for her hip replacement. I think I'll lay down now. Oh my god! I know what he is! This is the progenitor of the viewfinder. It's acceptable grammatically to use from whence. All right. All right. But I think it sounds, it's, I mean, if you use whence these days, you sound like a dick. From where is acceptable. Because, <laughs> If I said, hey, where were you? I came whence the bar. Why are you talking like that? Talking like what? <laughs> like a fucking, like a fucking dickhead. <laughs> and I realized I used it improperly that time. Oh! Oh! Hey! Get off of me! What the fuck? He's sucking out my life essence! My baddie be good spell.
Oh, that's when I want to leave. Okay. That's what that's for. For when I want to leave. Nope. Nope. Hey, no. All I can do is cry. Here we go. There we go. Now I got it. Come here. Come get. Hey, hey, give me that. Jesus Christ, grab it. Fuck's sake. Bitches. up there it doesn't seem like there's a place that I can climb anyway yeah I was gonna say I can't even climb up there okay that's for my way back High knees, keep those knees high. High knee, high knees. Oh, look at this guy. Uh oh. Are you okay, bud? Look at the oh. Damn it, that's what they meant by uh. Disturbing the past. Oh. They got me. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, they just put me on the right path. Thanks. Don't hold my hand, game. What do I think of the game? It's really good. Ha! Jars in the sand achievement. Um, yeah, it's really, really good. The music is fantastic. The, the atmosphere is this. You can see it. I love it. The puzzles are puzzling, but not, not over the top.
Is it 35 bucks? A 30 bucks on Steam. Um Depending on how long it is, yeah, I would say it's worth 30. If you can get 10 hours of gameplay out of it, I would say it's worth it's worth 30. It seems like I'm in a completely new room. And I'm hoping that was a checkpoint. Pretty sure that was a checkpoint. So, because I'm gonna, I'm uh, ending the stream just a bit earlier than, than I usually end my stream because I have comedy tonight. Gotta go to comedy, gotta get ready. Underscore carrot, underscore carrot, underscore carrot, underscore carrot, 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 underscore, underscore, underscore. Let's dance. Thank you, MC, for 25 months in a row. I appreciate it. Good to have you back, MC. Two years and a month. All right, so what we're